sporting legends and their most memorable performances. That's what you'll find on every edition of Visa Presence The A Game. I'm PV Sindhu and today's guest is a 23-time world champion in billiards and snooker. This is an incredible story of the prince of the green base, Pankaj Adwani. Three weeks after watching his brother Shri play billiards, Pankaj Advani just knew he had to pick up a cue. And the very first shot he attempted, he made. And since then, he's never looked back. The moment came when I was 18 years old, when I went on to win my first world title in China, when I was actually not expected to do anything over there. So uh, things happened very quickly for me. And I did realize at the age of 18 that I can actually make this a career and this is what my calling is. Pankaj took the World Billiards title for the first time in 2003 and was awarded an Arjuna the very next year, all while he was still only 19. But while individual glory was important to Pankaj, what really motivated him was the potential and possibility of winning medals for his country on the biggest sporting stages. At 21, while I had won a few world titles before that, I fe felt like the Asian Games was a different platform. Uh, there was loads of pressure because not only people from your fraternity are watching you, but the entire sporting world, uh, you know, and especially in the continent and even the Indian officials, the IOA, everybody has their eyes on you and the game because they want every game to get as many medals as they can. And that takes us to 2010 at the Asian Games in Guangzhou in China. Pankaj facing his stiffest challenge yet and it came at a time when the Indian team was struggling to put medals on the board. I know that we had won a lot of bronzes and silvers. I, I didn't know that this was going to be the first gold medal for India. So that pressure was not on me luckily. But the pressure of winning a gold and defending my gold medal at the Asian Games because I had won it in 2006 was definitely weighing heavily on me. Um, I was let off the hook in the first part of the frame in the decider and I realized that at 62 when I was when I was 62 points and I needed 38 more I made a very simple mistake and I felt like maybe this could be very costly and then I had the final blow and I said this time I'm going to compose myself take a little time and sure enough you know I have crossed the finish line but it's dealing with that kind of pressure and channeling it positively that has made Pankaj a very special athlete in a sport where mental fortitude is king. In the Asian Games, I didn't play my best in the final, but sometimes you just have to hang in there. Uh, and to win all the matches from, you know, uh, the quarterfinals onwards, to have all the matches go into a decider frame, 3-2, 3-2 in the semis and then 3-2 in the finals, gave me even more of a kick because I said, you know what, if I'm able to perform well under pressure and get past the finish line, it means that I've you know, brought out my A game at the right time. An incredible 23 world titles, two Asian Games golds, the Arjuna Award, the Rajiv Gandhi Kel Ratna Award, the Padma Shri, and most recently, the Padma Bhushan, are testaments to Pankaj Advani's ability to channel his A game and become a legend of Indian sports. That was an unbelievable story. 23 world champions in a 17-year career is an astonishing achievement. This is Visa Presents The A Game and I'm PV Sindhu and it's been an absolutely fantastic journey through some of the finest moments in Indian sports. Till next time, it's me, signing off. Goodbye.